Audi IL2 flight simmers. Today we're going to recreate a February 27th, 1942 mission where Japanese scout planes located the light aircraft carrier USS Langley CB1. And we're going to take up some G4M Betty bombers. We're going to take a different loadout that's got more bombs. That way we can have a bigger bomb spread. And we got the location zeroed in from the scout plane, so we're going to head that way with bombers and fighters. The fighters are going to deploy on the escort destroyer and split the anti-aircraft fire and hopefully distract them away from us. And the AI... Uh, plane got a good drop on the escort so we're gonna dive in uh, I'm not gonna level bomb level bombing moving targets is difficult I'm just gonna drop right in on this guy and the additional bomb load really paid out I got hits turn it away We didn't get a mission complete. I think we we're sunk the, uh, the primary target. We're going to turn back in. Give the wingman commands to attack the uh, escort. Yep, the, the Langley looks like it's hurt pretty bad. Trailing smoke. Looks like the uh, end is going down. Now, now we're going to draw fire. Second flight will be able to zero in on that destroyer. Now turn it away. And it sounds like the bombs are hitting the water. However, we got the primary. Here's an exterior shot of the bomb run coming in out of the clouds. Not giving the AAA gunners much time to react and dropping right in on the target. Here's an exterior view of the Langley. Took a big hit on the aft end. And she's going down. The escort is uh, really not a, much of a factor right now. So we're going to go ahead and clear out, head back to base. The G4M had a tremendous uh, flight range. She could fly 3,000 miles. That gave it the ability to hit uh, targets great distances in the Pacific, whereas Allied bombers couldn't touch it. And we made a good landing on the airfield. Going to taxi to the end of the runway. Let's give it some left break. Got a mission complete on uh, return to base. Thanks for watching this mission. Hope you liked it. I'm going to do a little research on some more uh, historical scenarios and hopefully have a video out soon. Thanks again.